Hi everyone. Welcome back to Storytime Shorts. Today's story is titled Rhyme Crime and it's written and illustrated by John Bergerman. Thanks to Dial Books and Penguin Young Readers for allowing us to share the story with you today. Wait, before we start this story, since it's called Rhyme Crime, there's going to be a lot of words in here that sound a lot alike, even though they're different words. So keep an ear out to see which words are different, but sound alike. Once upon a time, a thief committed a crime. Everything he stole was replaced with a rhyme. Hammy's brand new hat was swapped for a cat. Gum Pop's lovely head became a slice of bread. Arnie's comfy chair was switched for a what rhymes with chair? A bear. Toodle's loyal dog was taken for a log. Moo Moo's fancy clogs were swapped for some clogs. Frogs. Oh, that would make a very good shoe. They're slippy. They're not slippers. Gertie's pretty house was now a giant. Mouse. Marlo's happy smile became a crocodile. Dingle's mighty sneeze was swapped for stinky sneeze. <gasps> stinky cheese. Blue's yummy cake was taken for a snake. Sleepy Boomer's brain was switched for a train. <laughs> the thief took Thumble's orange and swapped it with a, what rhymes with orange? Um, Splorange, Smorange, Morange, Florange, Warange, Gorange, Zorange, Borange, Dorange, Porange. There's the thief. Is this the end of the tale? This thief was taken to jail. What terrible luck. I'm truly stuck. But by the very next day, the thief had run away. How did he escape? Do you see? He is off in a boat that he swapped for a goat. I hope you enjoyed this story today. For more stories, for science shorts, for craft projects, make sure you subscribe to our channel. Goodbye for now.